After starting it off right with two solid KOs, our next fight is against my man right here named Jeremiah McGee. Now, he caught my eye because if you look at him closer, he looks like a younger, skinnier, better looking version of the big train, doesn't he? And I can't have that message. It's already hard enough for me, you know what I'm saying? I don't need a younger, better looking version of me running around. So my plan here is to knock his ass out, get him out of the UFC for good so I don't look bad in comparison. And on top of all that, surprise my family got tickets for the show tonight. I don't want them to come watch my fights for like the first 10, 15 fights until I know what the hell I'm doing. So there was a surprise. And you know what happens whenever the fame's in town. I eat a lot. I try to show off and I get myself in trouble. So hopefully that doesn't happen. But it is an unexpected twist. I don't know how I'm going to deal with it. But I better figure it out quick. Because fight number three in my official UFC career is starting right now. And Jeremiah McGee, aka Fake Ass Big Train. You stopping at the next station you ain't moving anymore. Because I can't have you around anymore. Let's do it. Up next, it's a heavyweight showcase between The Flash and Big Train. The Flash? They call my man The Flash. The only thing flashy about him is going to be the knockout that I inflict on his face fake ass Big Train over Big here. Train. My family's in the crowd. They didn't, They weren't supposed to come over here. They're not supposed to be watching the matches in person until I'm like number 10 in the world or something like that. I'm still number 57. I got a long way to go, but they wanted to see what I do for my career. So I'm here to show my family the way I whoop that ass. And the way I'm going to do it is by knocking out fake Big Train over here once and for all, making sure he never shows himself in the UFC again. Look at that, he even stole my damn music. This is poor man's big train, Jeremy McGee. Jeremiah McGee, Jeremy McGee. I'll get the flash. Get out of here. The big train's about to run his flash ass over again today about the godless fight. Look for him. Let's see the tail of the tape. 23, 27. Look, he's 6'2, 6'1, 219. Damn. My man's a feather. He needs to go and eat some chicken palm and get his weight up. You know what I'm saying? Either way, it's going to be a hell of a fight. He's a boxer. I'm a boxer. My family's in the crowd. I can't disappoint him. Bruce Buffer, introduce us and let's get ready. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I got some new flashy things for the Flash, too. You guys are going to see this sometime during the fight. I'm not going to bust it out right away. It's going to be a surprise. But you're going to see it. But first, I got a body snatch. First, I got a body snatch, all right? Nah, stop attacking to recover. I know how to recover stamina. Come on, game. Let me get that new hook going. That's the real conviction right there. I finally got evolution points so I can actually buy moves now. So I got the conviction, the real one, the overhand right hand. And then I got another new, uh, it's a kick. You guys will see it soon. You guys will see it soon enough. If I don't knock him out beforehand. Oh, my God. Yo, Flash, get up. Flash, get up. No, no, no. You ain't going out like that. My family came all this way. There it goes. They came all this way to see a fight. I ain't gonna knock y'all in two seconds. I'm gonna make it worth their time. Oh, you better freaking duck. He just got freaking missed. Come on. Boom. 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 What's good? What's good, Flash? What's good, Flash? I'm about to flash that ass. Watch this. Ooh. Watch me. Oh. Oh, another one. Woo. Big Trey learning new tricks early on. I didn't learn this till like the very end of my career in the last one. Now I'm getting at it early. Come on. What's good? What's good? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Go on, throw. Get your ass out of here, Flash. Throw another one. Go ahead. Throw another one, baby. I want to knock your ass out. Why you got to make me do this, Flash? Why you got to make me do this? Oh, no. You a good kid. You a good kid, but you stayed it out the tracks, man. Hey, you know the big train got to do his thing. Let me get that stand in the back. Especially with my family in the crowd. Damn it. All right. All right, come on, Flash. Come on, Flash. What you got for me? Ooh, ooh. He felt the wind. The whiff of my feet almost knocked him out. I'm surprised with my sweaty ass feet. I'm surprised that didn't KO him right there. Boom. All right. What's good, Flash? What's good, Flash Gordon? Come on, throw one punch. One punch, man. Come on. One punch. I'll give you one free on the chin. Go ahead. Go ahead. Now get your ass out of here. Oh, no. Oh, no. I got too cocky. Oh, I'm not doing that. Mommy never to do that again. This man is still a heavyweight fighter. He can still knock me out at will. And I can knock his ass out, too. That's the thing. I can knock his ass out, too. He almost took me out because I'm trying to show off for my family. I told you I didn't want my family in the damn crowd. That's why I want them here because I start showing off. They know that. I eat too much. Everything happens. Uh, oh, 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 there we go. Ah, there we go. 
Let's get the right order of things back in line here. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, I'm swinging for the damn fences now. He almost knocked me out. I got to KO him. I can't look stupid. I can't look stupid from my fam. I can't look stupid from my fans, Flash. I can't do it. I can't do it. Oh, my God. This dude has a chin and a half. Nah, he's got no stamina left. He's done. He's done. He's done the conviction. Pounded out. Called it Herb Dean. Damn, that was close. That was close. But that's all right, though. They already know what I'm doing right here. You know what we eating tonight, baby. It's chicken parm all day with the fam. Meet me at Tino's on Fish Street if you want to join us. Everyone's invited. Ooh, almost got my ass knocked out playing around. Let's check out the action on our But fake ass, bum ass, poor man's big train finally went to sleep with the conviction. You know I always swing with conviction. It's the only thing to do. Ooh, watch this. White right hand. Whoa. Boom. That's just beautiful. That's just beautiful. Put it on a postcard and send it to someone. Because that was gorgeous. Whoa. Bam. And you know there ain't no rest in the UFC, so as soon as they put my fat ass back down on the mat, it was time to get ready for our next fight. So I've actually had a couple people ask me what difficulty I'm fighting at, because you remember last time in EA UFC 1, I did normal difficulty for Big Train's career, and then it was too easy, so we went up to pro difficulty for Confucius McCann's career, which was a little bit too up. I still did my thing. I went undefeated. Well, I, I, I had one defeat. I ain't going to defeat it. Anyway, so in this new one, they have what they call adaptive AI, which is supposed to be how the first fights are easy, and then as you get further and further along in the rank, the fights are supposed to get harder and harder, just like it does in real life UFC, how, you know, with a young prospect that they believe in, they have him face easy opponents first, and then when he gets into the higher rankings, then he starts facing the superstars, and that's when you see what he's really made of, right? So right now, the big train's under adaptive AI. I'm kind of liking it so far, because it's not like easy, easy, even though I'm knocking everyone out. But I, I'm assuming that as I get up in the rank, it's going to start getting harder. So if it doesn't, if it stays really easy and we're already like knocking out Minotaur and Nogueira and stuff like that, then we'll up the difficulty. But for now, I'm going to see where it goes. And where we're going right now is into fight number four against our boy Darwin Hall. Now, you know Darwin was the creator of the theory of evolution, so we'll talk about that before the fight. All I know is that it's survival of the fittest. And the Big Train ain't the fittest, but Big Train shows how he eats a lot of food. He farts all over the place. And he hits the hardest. So we'll see who comes out of this cage alive. Let's do it. Coming up next, it's a heavyweight collision between Big Train and Iron. Darwin Hall. That's my man's name right here. Darwin Hall. Now let's focus on the name Darwin, his first name. Now Darwin came up with the theory of evolution, didn't he? And the theory of evolution says only the strongest survive. So Darwin, if you try to survive here in the Serengeti that's called the USC, then why the hell are you standing on the tracks, babe? You need to get your ass off before the big train runs you over. Because you might have heavy hands. You might be ranked higher than the big train. But if you've been watching my first three, four, five, six fights, if you count the ultimate fighter, the big train knows how to throw right hook. He knows how to throw kicks. And he knows how to put your ass to sleep. So, Darwin, if you want to survive past tonight, I recommend you get out of this cage right now. Because the big train's rolling through your station. And if you're staying on the tracks, he's going straight over you. Let's take the uh, tape. 27, 25, 6, 1, 6, 2, 6, 2, 14. What's up with these light ass heavyweights? 214. Come on, man. They make me feel bad about my self image. I'm all fat and stuff over here eating everything in the damn buffet to come in at 214. Come on, man. Don't make me feel worse than I already am. You know, Bruce Buffer, forget the intro. Let's just fight. Big train. You ready? Iron. You ready? Here we go. Get out the way, Ezo I know you don't know where the hell you are. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, you saw that? He tried to throw a little body hook. No, I know how to throw body hooks, baby. You want to throw body hooks with the big train? I can throw body hooks. Come on. Come on. Bye. There we go. Start working in that leg kick. You know that's my rhythm getter. And I also use it to just to to, to, to get the, the distance right. Just to check it a little bit. Just check the distance. There you go. See if I can cut him down like a tree. You guys want some more takedowns? I got a takedown for you right here. You want some more takedowns? I got a takedown for you right here. I got a takedown for you. Uh, 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 uh. No, 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 no. All right. All right. I still don't know what the hell I'm doing on ground transitions. That's okay, though. That's okay, though. No, no, no. You ain't getting no, baby. You ain't getting no. What the hell is this? What is this? I'm never going to take a fight down again. I'm never taking a fight down again. Uh-uh. Get out of here. Hold up. Hold on. I'm going to sit on his back real quick. I'm going to sit on that back, baby. Hold up. Hold up. Let's go for the rear naked choke. Damn it. Damn it. Why the hell did I do this? I should just follow my gut. I should just follow my gut and stand up when I need to. The big train is a fighter, but he ain't ready to do these freaking ground games yet. 
I need to train in that a little bit more. But you know what I'm ready to do? I'm ready to knock someone out. Bow! Bow! There we go. Oh, damn. I understand you. I see you. Why do I keep calling him Nathaniel? His name is Darwin. Boom! One. Boom! There we go. There we go. Come on. Oh, you want some clinch game? We got some clinch game. We can work the clinch game a little bit. Let me give him that Muay Thai clinch, baby. Hold on. Boom. Boom. Okay. Ah, uh, he didn't want me to do the whip. He didn't want to catch the Nana either. Come on. Come on, man. Come on, man. You guys want to see a knockout? Ah, oh, damn. I'm going to give you a knockout. As soon as I... Oh, boom. 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 Ah, okay. Go for the leg kick. Go for the leg kick, big tray. Hold on. Go for something. You know they're going like this. Boom. Oh, he blocked it with his face. How did he do that? I'm my man blocking with his face, freaking Darwin Hall. Boom. Trying to give him some natural selection right now, but it ain't working. There you go. Body snatcher. Gauge the distance. Gauge the distance. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> it's a good fight. We're both kind of tentative. Oh, I ain't tentative with that, though. That two-piece. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, I almost caught him with the five-piece. I was trying to add extras to that combo. Boom. There we go. Look at the, the distance gauging. Oh, my ass. He knocked me out of my ass. Why you do that, man? Boom! Get your ass out of here. The big train throws head kicks like a beast. You don't know about that yet? Bam! Come on. Come on, Darwin. Natural selection, baby. Oh, oh he kicked me around my culo. Why you gotta do that? Come on. Come on. Oh, 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 nice slip. Nice slip. I'll give him that one. He freaking dodged that like it was the Matrix. They came back away. He ain't coming back with that, though. Come on, man. Come on, man. What else you got for me? The big train's ready to kick your damn head off. Come on. Come on. Boom. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Just hammer him, Thor. Just hey, He recovered. He recovered from that. Get up. Get up. I'll give you another one. Boom. Oh, 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 God. Oh, God. Oh, damn it. I was trying to throw the flurry at the end to take his ace out, but my man Darwin Hall, he's showing that he's fit. I don't know if he's the fittest. So I don't know if he's going to survive, but he's pretty fit. He took like three kicks straight. To Yo, who the hell just took the water ball out of my man's hand? I was just getting some alcohol, you know what I'm saying? The hell is that? Look at that. He went down. I couldn't finish. Puerto Rican throw was about to hammer him into non-existence, but nah. He got his ass. Oh, damn. Oh, oh that's nasty. That's just nasty. Oh, hey, Ariane. All right, round two. Round two. Got the way he's. Got the way he's about to be a flurry. It's about to be a flurry. Nah, nah. Get, you, get your ass out of here. Come on. Outside trip. Oh, damn. I was going for the. Hey, 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 hey. Nah, I ain't going down there with you. Okay, I'll go down there with you. Damn. Okay. Going for the takedown. He didn't want none, though. He didn't want none of this. He didn't want none of this. Come on. Come on. You want a conviction? I throw a conviction, baby. I throw a conviction, baby. Damn it. For people new to the series, if you don't know, the conviction is the right hand named by my friend and fellow YouTuber, Mr. Conviction. That's why I call the right hook the conviction, right? Huh? Bye. That's a conviction. I just missed it. When well, you see me throw the overhand right hand, that's a conviction right there. Come on. Come on, Darwin. Come on, Darwin. You don't want none of this, Darwin. You don't want none of this. Why is he even trying? He knows he don't want none. He knows he don't want none of this. Oh. Oh. Call him with the toe fungus. The athlete's foot is invading his brain as we speak. It's only a matter of time until it takes over him like the division. People don't know the division started when I took off my shoes one day after a long training session. That's why the whole infection started in New York. And that was the premise of the whole game. They still owe me royalties. I'm suing for it right now as we speak. Come on. Come on. Bye. Oh, you want some more athlete's foot? I gave you some more athlete's foot, Darwin. I gave you some more. I gave you some more. Bye. Oh, there you go. Oh, another one. Bye. DJ Khaled. Come on. You ain't moving nowhere. Ah, right, body snatch a little bit. If you want some of that. Uh, uh, there we go. Combos. Combos out the A, yo. Uh, 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 uh. My man will not go down for nothing. He might get a decision out of me if he stays freaking fighting like this. He got an iron chin. He might be the survival of the fittest. I don't think anything's going to kill this man except for those freaking high kicks. Oh, my God. Darwin, how are you still alive? Darwin, how are you still standing? How? Nice Someone tell me how. Nice Boom. Let me catch him with the two piece. Oh. Oh, another one. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh, damn. Okay. I see you. I see you, Darwin. I see you, Darwin. Do you see this, though? Do you see this, Darwin? Do, how, about, how about that? Do you see that? Jesus. Does he ever go down? He just took it flush, too. Let me see if I can take his ass down. Damn it. Oh, he was ready for that. He was ready for that. I was stupid. I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that, Darwin. I apologize. Hold on. Come on. What you got for me? Ah, uh, come on, man. What do you want? What do you want? How many freaking hooks do I need to land? No. Get oh, on oh, my ass. He almost took his foot straight up my butt. 
It was like shin deep. Oh, boom, boom. Oh, oh. How many times do I need to kick this man in the face before he actually goes down? This is ridiculous. Oh my God. He's going, oh, he hurt me. My man hurt me. I'm so freaking tired just for freaking throwing punches. Yeah, he hurt me with that. Oh, oh my God. Darwin, oh my ass. Darwin, why? Why won't you die? Oh, damn. I'm limping and crap over here. He hurt my leg. Boom, look at that. That's flush, too. That is flush. But he won't go down. I got to give it to him. This man has heart and determination. And he just chopped me down like a tree. My freaking leg is hurting. I don't know what the hell I'm going to do. He cut me up. No one makes me bleed my own blood. Come on, dog. You know you guys like these fights, though. Yo, yo you don't want to touch gloves with me? All right, ain't no takedowns happening in this round. It's going to be all up war right now. My man disrespected me by not touching gloves when I went to touch gloves. In fact, he went for the punch. Darwin, I have respect, but you just lost it right there. Boom. Here we go. Boom. There we go. Just gave the distance. I use that to actually... Oh, damn. I need to stop talking and start throwing. I was going to say I actually use those kicks to gauge when I'm in range for a head kick. But it didn't work that time. Oh, that worked, though. That worked, too. That worked, too. Oh, oh damn. Darwin, what are you doing? Darwin, what are you doing? Darwin, what are you doing? How many do I need to throw? Boom. Oh, oh, he caught me on the chin. Come on. I might have to throw that uppercut combo. Boom. 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 Pick him up. Throwing hands, big train. Throwing hands. Oh, he's throwing hands too, though. He's throwing hands, volley too, though. There we go. There we go. Take him down. Take him down real quick. Take him down real quick. Go to that top mount. Go to that top mount, big train. No, no, no. You stand right there, Darwin. You stand right there. What's he blocking? He ain't blocking nothing. He ain't blocking nothing. Back to half guard. Side control. Side control. All right, top mount there. Top mount there. Top mount there. What the hell is he doing? How did he get that off? All right, back to half guard. Uh, uh. Wait, no, 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 I hate that. I hate that transition. I hate that transition. It always works. It always works. What is he doing? What are you trying to do to me, Darwin? Oh, damn, I should have gone for the takedown. Why would I go for the takedown? Let me get back to full. Let me get back. No, let me get back to the sprawl. The sprawl will work for me. Which one's the get up? There we go. Half guard. Half guard. Pull it. He's got half. There we go. Let me go to the back sit down. I want to sit on your back, Darwin. I just want to sit on your back a little bit. That's all I want to do, baby. There we go. Let me get that back. Let me get that back. Two minutes left. Two minutes left. I want that rear naked. I want that rear naked, Darwin. I want that rear naked choke, Darwin. I want that rear naked choke. Damn it, that's BS. That's BS at a half. No, I'm getting up. I'm getting up. I'm getting up. I'm knocking this dude out. If it's the last thing I do in this fight. Come on, Darwin. What you want from me? You want another one of those? How about one of these? Oh, my ass. He always does that. Oh. Come on, man. Come on. Come on, Darwin. Boom. Oh. He's actually gauging my... He's gauging my kicks. Oh. All right. All right, 30 seconds. 50 seconds. I read the clock wrong. Read the clock wrong. Oh. 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 Damn it, Darwin. Why? Why can't you just go down? I want another knockout, Darwin. I want to knock on you ain't let me get it. Oh, he's hurt. Oh, I got I wanted it. Oh, another one. I know my ass. Come on, Darwin. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Spin kick out of big trade. Damn it. That was a freaking war. I shouldn't have gone for that takedown. I should have just kept it standing. I like to give you guys what you want because you say you want more takedowns, but... It ain't working for the big train. I gotta get my uh, my, my freaking ground game up a little bit, but I messed him up. I'm pretty sure I still won that fight, but I took too much damage. That's gonna show up my career span by a little bit. This fight was a damn war. I mean, I showed his career span by like 35 years on how many times I kicked him in the face and gave him the athlete's foot, but damn. He put some work into me too, and that was a good fight. Get the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for decision. All three judges. Look at my man's face. You know Big Train won. 30-27, come on. Just raise my hand, Eves. You know what? I don't look that bad. I got a little bit of a bruise on the left eye, but the right eye's good. His face is on the other hand. You know what I wanted to say, but he messed up over there. Pick me up. Pick me up, LeBron James. Thank you. And fake good with Melendez. 
Big Train is full on his official UFC career. I'm going to work out my ground game a little bit because I know you guys want some submissions and you want some more ground and pound action. And also, I forgot my ground and pound was was a little bit wacker because I was actually hurt coming into the fight, so I should have been trying to take it down. Either way, as always, if you have any suggestions below, either way, as always, if you have any suggestions, please leave them below in the comments. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you really enjoyed it and you have it already. There's plenty more EA UFC to come. We got four fights down, and if there's anything like UFC 1, we got about 36 more fights to go. So we got a lot of episodes left. So thank you guys for watching as always. I appreciate all the support. I love you, dude. And I'll see you later. Peace.